I have absolutely all respect for the churches and their views and those who support going to the referendum. A lot of the individuals who signed the request or the petition for a referendum actually support uh, this uh, legal industry that we are creating, but they want the Belizean people to decide that. So they're just saying in, in fairness and in terms of a good democracy, let the people decide. While we support it, let the people decide, and we have to respect that. And they seem to be convinced that the country will vote against it, uh, or the majority of the people who vote. What's the government's um, perspective on that? There has been some polling done, and what I can say based on the polling, um, a lot of Belizeans recognize that weed is not going anywhere. They take a very practical approach. Um, even the day after the referendum, if there's a no vote, we will still have cannabis in the country. That's a fact. You can still have 10 grams on you without anybody asking you about it. But what a lot of the people are saying is this vote really is about creating an industry for the country, creating more regulations in place to ensure that young children do not have access to cannabis. And it is also going to provide, specifically in this bill, 20% of all proceeds will go to rehab programs, which do not currently exist. Um, so a lot of the voting population, like I said, based on polling, shows that they understand the issue at hand uh, and that we are trying to make sense out of nonsense.